sound lock. Other one dies, obviously. It looks peachy. Look, Bentley, I know this is your first time out in the field, but you've got to lose it. If we're going to get to those clockwork parts, I need you on your toes. So, in plain talk, what's your status? Well, I've established myself in the basement. Yeah, pretty much. I'm good. And I'm hopefully gonna be like. Or I hope I'm not gonna be like dead tired. Man. All clear. How did you your first yeah. it did pretty well. well this operation is far How did your no reset now that the lasers and spotlights run online, go? Furry should be moving into position for your rendezvous. I saw you were live and, and I was ahead. I was there for uh, a few minutes. Simple flips army. Now to get access, you're gonna have to meet up with Murray. As expected. I assume that's bad. No problem. I'll just take the long way around. Memory serves, you need to jump and hit the circle. Oh today is the day. So do I. It shouldn't be hard because sub five forty is not. Hard. It's just that I just can't get it because sound works. I don't know, man. Please. I like the way every like second run dies here. Because sometimes I just can't get this jump. I'm gonna YOLO the next few skips. Just so guess why not. This pyro is bad, so... tired of Cairo, so I don't want to be stuck in Cairo. I'd rather just take a slow Cairo and then just get a, get a run going. <laughs> the intro level is a little bit broken in this game, but unfortunately, or maybe fortunately, it is the only level that is broken. Yeah, this game is has a very tense opening, the speedrun, and then kind of falls off and is slow and boring, maybe, if you don't like the game later on. But if you like the game casually, the speedrun is probably something you will like. That was a very slow Cairo, but whatever. Carmelita's That's just like 20 seconds off perfect. She's really quite lovely when she's angry. And that constable Neela. 
Was a reference to the claw game just a slip of the tongue? Or an intentional clue? You love this game? A lot of us love this game. Only lead on the, missing clockwork parts. the coin count. Feed when I have no clue how many coins I have. For the Clan's I should have like 20 to 25. Is it inappropriate to refer to him as a monster? No, not at all. What kind of person stays alive? Beat this PlayStation 3 with a Warhammer. I have other games to run on this game, uh, this console, so hopefully not. That first decision to replace his mortal body with soulless machinery. Ultimately, it did the trick. Clockwork lived on. He caught up with my parents. And I wound up in an orphanage. Um, Cairo skips. Uh, the series of out of bounds glitches I just did. It's actually pretty recently discovered. Two years ago, I thought I as in a few months old, I guess. Three, um, three months or so. And now he's back. In pieces, sure, but the threat is real. Does the claw gang even realize what they've stolen? Yeah, slow when every level is broken, pretty much. I don't know what's in my future, but I won't let it's it. Like, be well, I don't know. It's just the weapon, I guess. Or simple, maybe. <laughs> I tried to. Uh... To connect to merge MQH. That's one of the problems that I have. I don't always think ahead when I start sentences. So I end up having like having to to see together some words midway through the sentence. With some awkward pauses. Underworld celebrity, equally at home in high class art circles and shady back alley crimes. Six fingers. He was once a passionate young art student. Yeah, I think that actually. I think that's true. His own visionary style. Also, hey, button. Unfortunately, the art world wasn't quite ready for his kinetic aesthetic. So I'm not French. And started forging old masterpieces. His way of punishing those. Five thirty cents for the time. Well, the timeout though. Dimitri now runs a nightclub Nazi on the west mods, side. Don't scheme. The thumping music, <laughs> colorful light shows, and a hint of danger lure in Like my goal is um and it's here, hidden somewhere. less than five hours and forty minutes in total from the timer starts. So five hours and thirty minutes would be like a perfect time. But I can't get such a good time. So like 537 is I think my optimal goal maybe I don't know I want to say that but the thing is the game likes to uh, to crash on me Something called a sound lock. And that kind of prevents me from uh, reconnect. T uh, prevents me from like putting my goal that low. Also nice, I'm starting to drop a few frames again. But if I had no sound box, I would probably change my goal to like sub 538 or something. And eventually I will probably probably push it that far down. But I want to focus on Hundo and uh, IELTS. The game freezing on clock low. What pace were you on, Mikkel? Like, w were your next. Wait, were your current PB on better pace than the one that crashed? Because if so, then. In my opinion, it doesn't really matter, but. If it was on better pace, then that sucks. 
Hey Tyrion. I got hosted by Simple Clips. I think the host was on. Like the size of the host was about 104 or something. Which means he probably had like 140, 150 viewers. Dude, who turned out Simple Flips? The hell? Do we have a crazy mod? Um, oops. Don't stop that timer. Ninjas, please. <laughs> please don't abuse your mod status. So your current PB was better? Okay. Even this run is just as bad as the last one, even though I got the cutscene skip. Because I accepted a cargo that was like 15 seconds worse. Just because I don't want to be stuck in Cairo. I don't need a god like Cairo for my goal. Barely. you go. To get over this thing, you'll have to double jump. Hit the X button to jump. Then, while in the air, press it again to get some extra air time. Like you're on your own from here. I'm used to it. Thanks for the help. Anytime, partner. I will clip the vent because this one is bad. So I want to save those two seconds. Forty coins. Yeah, I'm on pace to save about. 10 seconds. Yeah, it's true, Sagoon, but th the thing is, I don't need a good early game in order to uh, to reach my goal. So I don't want an like, excessive reset on something that's not necessary. It's also the hardest skip in the game in my opinion, so... To less than 9. Too nice. I do have the reduced stream delay option selected. Or checked.
but Sagoon, if my goal was uh, say 538 or 537 then I will probably reset this run already I would probably reset already when I had like a bad Cairo if that was the case Yeah, like, the less resets you have, the better experience you will have, unless you, like, really uh, can't stand having mistakes, but if you can't stand having mistakes, you should run a shorter game, in my opinion. There's no way I can run this game without having a single mistake. Though my PB actually doesn't have any huge mistakes. Except for the last split. Yeah, I like to reset if, even if I can't PB. Wait, I like to <laughs> to finish even if I can't PB ra rather. Where is Dimitri? Should I just... Where is he? Who's got the juice? Smooth. Dig the kinetic. Kinetic aesthetic. Make art. Breathe art. Feel art. Uh. <laughs> yes, again. Annoying. Very last split. But it's okay. I know how to uh, recover from that. Or like I know how to not make that happen. Like since last run, I have practiced a few things, but not too much actually. Um, just a few things that I've screwed up, and or like. What I've done instead of uh, practicing jobs is that I've been, uh, I mean, kind of making safer strats and alternative strats and like things to watch out for. For example, in Spice in the Sky episode 6, I have made like a place to aim, I guess, um, to not hit the lock and die because that happened in my PB and that's like a free 30 plus second time loss and also in episode 8 I made a little something that's easier that I also screwed up in my PB Slow strats or old strats, actually. They're not slow. They make these rats more annoying.
I have lost count. Okay. Uh, I lost a minute, a minute and ten, I think, or a minute and five second. Uh, the mistake cost me fifty. Actually, I can just like, check. We skip to the very end. Oh god, there's so many splits though. A minute and five. So we'll be able to listen in on this conversation. Can I make it back in time? No, <laughs> I skipped this segment. Whatever. <laughs> well, oops. Didn't see anything. Hey, sarcastic. Skip one split too many, but it wasn't a gold, so doesn't matter. That's all right. I never was one for the direct approach. Well, because the indirect approach way up there through that air vent. And this probably won't be a gold either. This was like a pretty average bug, Dimitri. Like that can actually be gold, but then again, if that's gold, then I can easily beat that, so. Exactly, Sagoon. But I'm probably gonna bounce ahead sometime. We don't skip this uh, job briefing or this uh, slideshow because we get a uh, loot. Uh, when we finish Bug Dimitri. And if you skip this cutscene, then you don't get the loot. It would save me like 10 seconds to skip. But I skip smaller than 10. Well then. It saves about like 15. So I lose 15 there. I have been like wondering. Nice. Um, they're gonna sh I've been wondering if we do the optimal like loot route. Because say you don't do that one, you don't do the one in episode two. But you get the one in episode 5 instead. Does that... I don't know what's faster. This one wastes about 15-20. Episode 2 wastes about 15-20. So that's 30 to 40. And I seem to recall the episode 5 one being about 50. So if that's correct then it's not worth it. Also I s screwed up the setup. Shouldn't matter. Still got two shoes cases.
I don't think you need paralyzer, but hmm, how many coins would you get casually? Could you get 600 coins by the time? I don't think so. Hmm. Is I thought if you get uh, turn back launch maybe, which is something that I may look into after Hundo. It depends. Like, I haven't made uh, absolute bans on what to do after Rando yet. One thought is returning to any percent. Um, and one one thought is to move on to slide 3. One thought is to move back to slide 4. One thought is to branch out to other games, you know, so... I don't know. Many things I can do. I don't know what I will feel like at the time. Congrats you guys. Yay. I'm doing well in coins. Slide 2 is my main, but it's always fun to uh, take a break from your main speed game. Well done, Sly. We should work well together. Glad you approved. Legally, I can't enter the and I could easily PB in Slide 3, since I didn't do a cutscene skip that is was found afterwards. That saves about a minute, I think. And then I have a better or a faster hard drive, so that's a few minutes for free. So there's some thoughts. So one thing that I might want to do is like say slide two any percent sub five forty slide two hundred percent sub six ten or maybe even sub six I don't know what's a good time yet <laughs> um and then move on to slide three see if the game sound knocks on me if the game sound knocks on me. Then we shut down slide 3 and move back to slide 2. And then do any percent again, I don't know. That's one thought. You serious? Bad theater so far. Please have two. Okay, good. No, I need this first try. That's not first try. This is gonna give me bad cycles on the last two guards. Or not. Okay. That works. Those are very good cycles. Hey, butters.
Okay, that works. Okay. Overall, pretty good theater. On my head. My PBS are 31, uh, 38, episode 1. This is on pace to be a 31, 30. Where am I going? In the green for now. <laughs> for now is the keyword there. Cutscene skipper is. If I take a damage, or if I take one point of damage uh, on accident in this tunnel, I always go for the cutscene skip. That is almost not faster. But it's faster if you take damage. Because if you take damage, you can't punch or hit the bomb at the end, losing you like an extra second, or half a second, I don't know. So it becomes more worth it if you take damage in that tunnel, if that makes sense. Feel when the guard shot me and hit the bomb. Just with the quick scoopers. Yep. Pretty sweet card. Yeah, it saved me some time because I missed the bomb on the first swipe because uh, apparently I auto target the guard. Um, seven to eight, that's 15. Sound lock, here we come. Wow, grammar, please. <laughs> hey, grammar. Um, yes, it hit. Get in position, Murray. Murray needs to take his line and get in position there for that loading zone to be there. Or no, to for you to be able to like bomb the uh, the thing. I mean, success. Oh boy, dropped frames three thousand three hundred and thirty. Two? No, <laughs> I'm one frame away. The funny thing, Cooper, is that before I started reading it, I read 3333. 
so I didn't realize until afterwards. Or until midway reading it. Mike, I said. <laughs> nice, I see. That's five seconds lost from missing cock strats. And like two seconds from getting back. So like seven seconds lost right there. Murray, please. Murray and his master, tr master troll. What is that picture, Tower? Let's see. Dude, why is my... Why is my zoom? Like 250%? What the hell? Yeah, I love like 6 or 7. Spot the gay man. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> I don't... <laughs> okay. See ya, Jake. Sleep well, man. Okay. Those are some big boots. Yep. Crazy sweet. Grammar. How did she? I think. I think. I think must be she, isn't it? Well, I don't know. How did it say my name or pronounce my name? Did it go like G Nyston or? Ginniston or Ginniston or I don't know. The spam is wheel. Mm -hmm. Why did I miss? Um, okay. Don't shoot me again. Master of Trolls. Bad Dimitri fight so far. Where are you teleporting now? Your friend Jin and Okay. I see. Bad operation. Missed cock strats, that's five seconds. Um bad meter fights. Which cost me like five, six seconds. And then I attempted cock stress twice, so that's like another 
second and a half. And suddenly, that's 13 seconds. 12. Due to the untimely arrival of Carmelita, my escape got a little tricky. Angry at having just missed me, she took it out on Dimitri. Shutting down the nightclub and throwing the frustrated forger behind bars. The gang and I headed out of town for a week in Monaco. I figured the team had earned themselves a well-deserved break. Improvable gold. I could, I could save 10 seconds though. That's the thing, Cooper. Had a better split in my PB too. So I lost 13. Or like 12, 13, that's my estimate. Compared to some of best, plus 14. It's pretty good, I guess. A self-made man who grew up poor on the streets of Calcutta, he started his life a crime selling illegal spices in the black market. Eventually going behind from a small average, outfit dude. to a sizable God. operation, and earning himself a seat in the prestigious At claw least I'm not behind the worst, some of worst segments. Hey, Hanson. And while he goes to great lengths to convince How's the run going? It's going okay. I could be minus 40 at this point, but whatever. His newly purchased ancestral palace. The reason? To show off his latest acquisition, the clockwork wings. The symbol of my enemy. If you saw the wings silhouetted against the night sky, it was already too late. Like if I compare against best split times. Yeah, I'm 45 seconds behind best split times. Which means that I've had a run being 50 seconds ahead. against your best segments. Challenge accepted. I'll do it for a few splits. No, actually, shit. I'm comparing ag against the pure RNG splits. Never mind. I'm not gonna compare against some of the best. <laughs> Again later on though. Just not for the splits. Nice movement though. Kappa B. Sagoon disapproves. Bible thump. Hey, Armin. I'm pretty certain I got a guard on the other side now, which sucks. Oh, I didn't. Okay. Good. 
Nice. I'm not sure it was a good time, but that I think that's actually pretty good, isn't it? <laughs> RNG doesn't like me today. I've been getting I've been getting good RNG the last like two uh, runs, like one guard or something. That picture. <laughs> Second of Kit Goat. How many guards are those? Or how many guards are that so far? Four? I had three in my PB, so. I think. Five? I'm behind. That was what? Five guards? Seven guards? I lost count. Bad RNG anyway. 12 plus 23 is 35. I lost 35 seconds, which is perfect RNG. Still be ahead. By the time I finish this episode, I think my PB is on my episode two is pretty good. In my PB, it's that run of thirty-four. No, yes, thirty-four. I don't know, thirty-four, thirteen, thirty-four, ten. I don't remember, dude. Somewhere around there. Which means very good. Also, I don't want to get the wine, but sure. I decided to stream late today. And then, like, do like a long ish stream. How do I have a tie? It's the same time as uh, Mikkel has. Mine was faster if you count like frames and stuff, but I don't care about that. It's funny to have a to have a, to have a VR tie. Exactly what I wanted. Slide three, probably soon. TM okay, don't do two square inputs there. Exactly, question mark. How far? 650, maybe? I don't know, really. I need to look into it first. Are you seriously gonna stop now? Calm the fuck on. Wasn't too much uh, too big of a deal. 
What's the world record? Uh, 703. <laughs> Feeling the world record holder doesn't even know. Hey, Drushy. But my guess is uh, 650. Without really knowing, that's just like what I get, what my guess is. And if you grind long enough, you can probably go like all the way down to 6:45, 6:40 maybe. Probably not 6:40. You got a tuxedo? But that's the same thing as saying this game can go all the way down to six or five thirty. No no when how many months ago now? Seven? Eight? We were like, yeah, sub six is possible but it's very hard. And then half a year later. We're saying the same thing about the time that's thirty minutes lower. How to How do you even run Pokemon Coliseum? You reset for twenty days, getting a good Espeon? Then you start to run. You pray to God you get a good cro uh, Croconaw. And then you go fast. There's actually a glitch in Pokemon Coliseum uh, that we abuse, where you can uh, use the Master Ball, and then you can, or use any ball actually, and then you can reposition the ball in the inventory, inventory before the turn is active because you have this only double battles, and that will make you uh, throw the mass or throw a Pokeball. But it has this nice the stats of a master ball, so you can like catch whoever you want. Pretty much. <laughs> this split is horrible so far. There is a campaign, yeah. I'm gonna need help. Thank you. Perfect. Jukes. Ha! <laughs> nice. Useful guards, Kappa. <laughs> Not even the direction I wanted to go. Yeah, Espeon has pretty good stats and whatnot. And the game is actually quite fun to speedrun because both Croconaw, or I mean both Feraligatr and Espeon uh, learns Protect. Or you learn it by TM, I think. So you can like manipulate the AI and you can use Earthquake and everything. Set up perfectly. This run has a horrible early game so far. I can be a minute ahead at this point. Instead, I'm almost 20 behind. Or I can be more than a minute ahead if I get like perfect RNG. <laughs> I missed this cutscene skip, okay. This run hates me.
I want to reset this for now, but I'm gonna keep going. I'm gonna go YOLO on this job, and if I die, then I reset, I think. Or YOLO to a certain degree, of course. Bad ending. I hate this run. I'm gonna go YOLO for the rest of the episode. Actually. Because I lost more time than I thought I would. And this run wasn't any good either. Uh, anyway. Like, if you compare against... Well, some of best, for once, is... Two minutes and 40 seconds, and I haven't even played for an hour yet. I count losing a minute and 30 per hour in this game. Like, okay. That, that's okay. Which means I want to be 1 minute and 10 ahead of whatever I am now. Which is... 40 seconds ahead. Which I've been several times. If I, can, if I compare against best split times. I'm even like 44 behind average, dude. <laughs> well, I don't need a perfect run to get my goal. I don't even have a time save until Spice Grinder. Driver issues are the worst. How posh can I sound? Not very. It's not like I'm Swedish or anything. <laughs> oh, sly. Nice. I don't need to be this negative though. I'm only 
negative because it looks very bad on the graph. But honestly, this graph has a differential of 40 seconds, so any time save or time loss will look huge when it's not. Oh, I glotted though. My goal is um, sub 540. That's why I haven't reset yet. How much did I even gold buy? Yeah, 0, 0.0 of course, since I... So that's I saved 0, 0.0. That's the only possible outcome. I'm stupid. Yeah, and it's also that way for me, Armin. Hey, thank you for the host milk. I remember seeing you were live, but I've forgotten what it was. But how was your stream? Thank you for the host, Armin. Twenty minutes on the last few spits. Damn. Stream was bad. Hmm. You couldn't beat the game, okay. That always sucks. Get a spit. I haven't really, I haven't really done much today. I'm just. Another gold, nice. I've only um. Derped on Twitch. Mostly in demons chats, and then I've derped on YouTube. Then I've seen some anime, and that's literally it. When you go to back to back and save point one on some of us. That door looks pretty heavy. Maybe I can crawl on that hole under the steps and find an alternate route. Herp a derp. Rack attack. Mm -hmm. Hey turtle and hey Jarowan. Sorry for butchering. Wow, you sure look spooked. Job well done, Sly. Now comes the This looks like Wind Waker. How much have you been drinking, sir? <laughs> There's almost no water in this game. Or actually, the maps tend to be surrounded by water, but. I guess the uh, the style is like from the same time period, so in that regard, it's probably it's a similarity, I guess. Why is Mountain Dew so expensive in Norway? Even I've never seen a Mountain Dew in any Norwegian store, so I don't know. But yeah, everything in Norway is expensive. Now focus on the other one. That is true. Yeah. 
the hell is CC mod? CC. I don't even know what that can be, dude. Sure. CC Coop. I don't know. Hey, clue bottle. Yeah, light, light. Well, late stream for once. Store in Hammer. Okay. Only been to Hammer once. When I was on or to the gathering like two years ago. Four kroner. That's actually insanely expensive. Uh, I can't even do it from this side. I'm stupid. What a sloppy room. I also have to be safe here because no HP. I see to lose a bunch of time. <laughs> Had to convert first. The Norwegian Crone, Crone is like really weak at the moment. Without the price really changing in Norway. So you guys need to work together to keep the thugs off my back. Yeah. Side by side. Hey, P3 Druga. Druga, Druga. Sort of butchering, of course. Teach me some sly. If you bring a PS3 controller, I might show you how to do a rich high jump, but like it's very simple though. The only thing that actually works if you want to learn Sly, is just learn the glitches, the tricks, understand why they work, and then play a lot. I'm yeah, I'm probably losing time there. Level four access. So thirty six first run, that's very good. I know my first run was not that good. I wonder if this still can be a, a 35 episode uh, 2. If I get the cutting skip. Well, I should add about 8 minutes from now. That's like the perfect time with, with this run. And that is like a mid 35, isn't it? Actually, I'm losing time on the splits, I just realized, so... I like 6 minutes now. Or 8 minutes, rather. Level one 3 in episode 1 is pretty good. Oh, 
Karen, thank you. Hasta luego. Well, that's how to fail setting up fast. I'm gonna lose a bunch of time here, like 20 seconds. Ah, not that much actually. 10 seconds. If even, what the fuck? Fine then. I call 20 seconds and I lose 3. Oh god, dropping frames again. Yeah. But it shouldn't take too long until my family decides to go to bed. And then I shouldn't drop any frames. Aww, thank you, Simple. Like, saying that to someone might seem like very cliche or something. But it's actually a like, very good like feeling if someone tells you that. Though I'm not very good ex at, at expressing myself, so... But thank you. The only problem I have with my, my own stream is the way I always breathe into my mic. And... Sometimes my voice... That's too early, yeah. And f the fact that I stream at irregular times and drop frames. Thank you, Kuldra. Thank you, Armin. Actually, it does mean quite a lot. I'm sorry for the drop frames. It's I missed the cutscene skip because I entered the trigger too early, so gonna lose 30 seconds here. Um, which one didn't break? Nice rock. I didn't, didn't even see that rock. <laughs> I know that field kill bottle. That's pretty good, uh, Armin. I know my first was not sub 37. I don't remember the exact time. But I think it was 40 something. And then my next turn was a 37 something. It looks like Bentley's little distraction did the trick. Initiate phase two. I'll take care of Sounds about right, the Cooper. You handle the heavy lifting. I assume this segment time is gonna be like 8 to 10. So I'm gonna lose about a minute and 10. Or eight, a minute and 9. So 145 ahead. Uh, behind? No, not that much. Wait, eight? No, seven thirty-five. Seven thirty. Dude, now I'm. I don't know what I'm saying anymore. Dude, nice clue bottle. Are you a good dancer? No. And um. I've probably told you this before, but in uh, gymnasium, second year in gymnasium, in gymnastics, we actually had to uh, to make a dance and perform it in front of class in groups, and like half the class just bailed that lesson. I didn't because I don't bail lessons. Uh, that was awkward. 
I, w I also fucked up, of course. <laughs> you dance with me? I did three wrong inputs there, that's scary. Yeah, it is breaking, I know. It's just that it's very stupid, in my opinion. The most stupid part about it was that you had to perform in front of the class. And like all the boys in our class, or all the men in our class, had like no way or no insight in dancing. So that was funny. Hey, Memk or Mimk? The men. <laughs> Well, second year gymnasium, I was 17, I think. Oh shit. They actually damaged Murray? Now I've seen that too. <laughs> this is tits. Yeah, I was just tits, man. Yeah, Murray took damage. I missed like two guards. There's seven. Did I say seven? I meant seventeen. <laughs> were, were we eighteen? No, we were seventeen. I think we were seventeen. Thank you, Hopi, I know. Not a horrible episode too, I guess. At least for missing the cutscene skip. And having like, what, six or seven guard RNG. I missed the cutscene skip at the very beginning of the jobs again. Yeah, maybe I lost like a second and a half or something to memory taking damage. It's always correct. It took some detective work, but the gang and I managed to track down where Rajan had gone into hiding. Somehow, he'd managed to transform a long forgotten temple into the throne. Well, my t first time saving is coming up soon. It's, um. Spice Thunder, I can say 36. Forced us to walk a long distance to our target. We ran into a few problems along the way, but pushed on. For the temple, I like to mesh buttons. I don't, I don't want to lose frames. To the 
Slither is a bad game. Yeah, miss the cutscene skip bass, which loses you about 30 seconds. And then I also had like, what, I think it was 7 guards RNG. But let's say 6, because it's either 5 or 7. Um, which is very bad. So, that's like, say, cut off a minute from that. Certainly the episode is very good. Wait, I'm not supposed to mash that button. I wanna... Hey, Corrupt. I wanna compare against... Yeah, 4.6 to Kibler and 4.9 to Mikhail. Two minutes behind best split times. That's okay. I don't need the run. Like, if I don't get the run now, but still PB and sub 540, then I can easily, like, just get sub or the run some other time. Uh, enjoy dinner, Cooper. Good luck, hope you survived dinner. Okay, we're gonna go ham now. We're gonna go quick style on all, on all the pictures. I say and get a slow ass rush on picture. And a slow ass entrance picture, nice. At least the crane controls wasn't too bad. I saved time now. <sighs> Gotta mash fast. Can I save time on water bug? No. Fuck. <laughs> How good is my episode 3 world record? It's uh... It's okay. It's nothing speci special. It's 30, 34.51. You can go like 20 seconds lower, I think. If I had my VR level splits, what would your time be? Well, episode 1 wouldn't be accurate because. Um, some spice plants in the elephant's feed bag. He chows down, gets all crazy, and then presto! Let's say you calculate the differences between... Or actually, if we do like uh, the best possible, the best time that has ever been achieved in episode 1 any percent in any percent run, using the, uh, the any percent route which is a 31.06 by me and the world record in episode 2 which is 34 Zero zero, also by me. Um, I got both of those in the same any percent run, and that is my current best split times. So if I compare against best split times, which is that, that's how I'm doing to like episode world records, approximately.
<laughs> That's slow. If this would have been slide three, that would have been fast, but it's slide two. again. Only 29 more bottles. Hey Cole. Okay, freeing the elephant. Nothing special. I failed the jump from the wine onto the other wine once. Which is like two seconds. But I see. Welcome back, Cooper. Didn't take long. Kappa B. I should compare against best segments. I should compare against Cooper. Ah, dude. Best segments. Let's compare against best segments until the end of eating Rajon. If the run survives that long. Very early. <laughs> I've been shooting up that jump so many times that I went like hella early. Pretty good water bug run. Almost a full second. Um, if you pay attention here, Cooper, to the uh, segment timer, you will see the effects of SSD versus HDD. Because I know you told me that uh, it takes 48 seconds to get to the mission trigger here. I'm probably gonna get a 47. 47 flat. If not lower, that's a uh, high 46. Rajan is out for his daily tour of the operation. My sources claim he always carries three blueprints on him, which, when read together, tell you everything about his spice operation. Too bad he doesn't have that section of the clockwork heart we saw during the recon. You could just pump him full of sleep darts and we could all go home. Fortunately, my sleep darts aren't powerful enough to affect Rajan. What? How are you going to get at those blueprints? Rajan has an insatiable appetite for Indian watermelons, which, if he holds, will force even him. I don't think he gives two fucks. 
comments after are one fuck and three fuck. Fucks. with a sonic disruptor. The strange sounds they make should be enough to lead the ever curious Rajan from place to place. Am I good at slide glitches? I'm okay. I don't really know like all the uh, the glitches. I just know the glitches that are useful for a speedrun. Like fake floor and Get high jump and square boost. Etc. Are you coming? Yeah, I decided to compare against best segments until the end of this job. I don't want to say who's the better slide runner. Pretty good split. Now that I compare against PB again, I'm gonna be less behind than I were. Yeah. See, it works to compare against some of best. If you are to say who's the best sly runner. You obviously have to combine all the times in their four respective games, meaning whoever has not has run zero of the games are the best runner. Because they would have zero seconds as the PB. So that was a slow reset because I didn't match start. I don't want to claim who's the better runner, better runner in any game because it's mostly open for discussion for all the games. I think there's always like one or two, maybe even three runners that are like up there for all the games. Though I can say pr pretty clearly that MSA is the best life war runner. That was pretty sloppy. <laughs>
Armin is like still on the same joke. Sitar uh, ran this game like what five years ago? Not that, not, not that much. But like several years ago without a route or anything, I'm pretty certain. There was also other runners, like Salocto that did like one run. But the boards were cleared when somebody uh, abused the fact that you didn't need video evidence. And when it was discovered, we made it so that ev uh, video evidence is required for the main leaderboards. Which makes everyone that ha doesn't have a video evidence to their time lose their spots, essentially. Did that sentence even make sense? I hope so. If you check uh, SRL, there was some races of slide 2 very much back in the day. Like for example, uh, Samurai Man, Ricky, and some others did an uh, Beat Dimitri race, for example. I don't remember who finished, but I think like, all of them crashed or something, so... Yeah. Okay, safe strats. I can go way faster here, but because of my loads, I started being inconsistent because my loads were too fast. So I actually made slower strats here after about an hour of practice. I figured that my current stress didn't work properly. I'm actually gonna wait. I'm gonna wait. I could probably have made that cycle, but. Honestly, it wouldn't have been worth it. Save maybe a few seconds. When I can, when I'm already saving a little, lot of, a lot of time here for free. I don't need that extra one and a half second. Not when my goal isn't like sub a good time. It's just sub a meh time. I am from Norway. West of Norway. West part of Norway. Triax has the VR in slide 100. <laughs> 216 by Triax. Is that the one? I don't know. I think, I think that's actually any percent, isn't it? Bob was the first scooper. If you take Sly 4 as a serious Sly game, then yes. If you don't, then no. Like, I don't mind Sly 4 being true or not. Sure. Let them change the 
original game and creators material and lore. It's called development. Kill that card, please. Fine. Didn't to die. Nice. Intro percent, oh god. Um, nice card. Did you stop? For like... A little while? Please don't make this card. Okay, he wasn't even here. Never had this outcome in this job before. Well, Penelope is also the bad guy in Slide 3, eh? at least for a set period of time. And that's why you're not a leaderboard smart, Armin. <laughs> also, I'm sorry, I don't really keep up with chat too much at the moment. There it is. Just like Mila said. Like, if I were a leaderboard mod, which I'm actually interested in being, but I've never given the fuck to actually like ask and stuff. Then I would be like a serious mod. And I would probably know life the boards. Knowing myself correctly. I need to make those stress proper. Um, nice. Do I actually have to practice this again? I used to be the most consistent per person on earth with that jump. Hey, IDM. Oh, you've been talking for a while. Sorry for the delayed high. Also, hey, Aero and Tempos. And MHMD. Nice. When you can't even read letters. Like some people take speedrunning very serious. Some people take it very unserious, and some people they just want to be like they just want to speedrun, and they like dis uh, despise all drama and all that kind of stuff. And I feel like I'm one of those guys. I just want to speedrun. I don't care about people splicing, or I care about it, but like I don't want to make a big deal out of it. Sure, ban him from the that game. Never give him a mod in any game. And 
move on. Right. Um, this guard though, hello? What's your... <laughs> what? <laughs> okay. Hopefully this won't screw me over. Okay, he's already dropped me, so... Reminder that I am a no life and I am level 58 in the demon's chat. Which doesn't even make me top 5. I'm like rank 7, I think. <laughs> when you're sloppy when GSMing and you almost pay the price. This is the day you almost caught Mr. Risky. As fast as possible with cheats. By cheats, do you mean like cheat codes in the game or third party software and stuff? This has been a pretty good episode 3 so far. Comparing in some of best, I haven't actually lost too much time. Just a normal bit, normal amount. As you can see, I'm like saving a lot of time on all the comparisons. when I've forgotten what action replay actually is. <laughs> like the thing is with speedrunning, as long as one runner is serious about it, it can be a serious category. Like for example, uh, Sonic Adventure 2 Battle. There's a category called 120 emblems. Or 180 emblems, actually, 180. <laughs> um, you get 180 emblems, which um, means that you have to literally sit there for 9.5 hours if you're playing perfectly and play that game doing both uh, the main categories, followed by a lot of like mini stuff and all the challenges or whatever and there's one serious runner called Talon 2461 very entertaining very good guy and like if you per definition that category is is a meme who the hell Place a nine-hour-long category for for serious talent does making that category a proper category. And that's like uh, I forgot what word I wanted to use. 
It's admiring, maybe? Do you see someone do that, you know? Yeah, like several hours is just doing chow stuff. Yeah, somebody ran Animal Crossing a few times. Talon has a thousand attempts in that game, or in that category, if not more. If it wasn't 1200. Whip and Hundo. Yeah, that was blind though, and, and in a race. Like, you can push Hundo down to six hours. I'm pretty sure. And I will do that sometime. Hopefully after this run, which will be the sub 540. Even though it's bad. But I can save time in episode 4 and 5, so... Like, I'm entering the places where I can save time now. Wait, I... I ran, or I walked, like, a... An extra second. But anyways, that to me is admiring. The, the fact that you can just... Single-handedly make a category... Optimized, viable... And he also pulls, like, hundreds of viewers. And people are legitimately interested in how how his run is going. Like Ricky, post or he was between runs. It, he didn't want to start another one because Talon was about to finish on PB pace. So while he was streaming, he was watching Talon run, and he also like linked his stream and chat, giving him, him like a shout out. And that to me is something that you can like achieve. Also, if I have a perfect operation, I think this can be EP3 Recky, maybe. Not that I really care. Skyrim run to 6%. Ah, oh, yeah. It's now down to 20 hours. 20 days. Well, okay. <laughs> I will turn up my bitrate for this, actually. Because this fight is the bitrate killer, so I assume higher bitrate makes it less shitty. Okay, I'm lucky. I survived that. That has killed runs before. Not for me though, luckily. Episode record by six seconds. Also gold by four and a half, which means if I tied my gold, that would have been like a 
a meme time, a one second PB. Just as I promised, the Cooper gang and Rajan all incapacitated. Excellent police work, Constable Mila. Carmelita's never been able to catch the Cooper gang. Yet you capture them in just a few short weeks? Well, I never... Really, Carmelita. Accept your defeat gracefully. Actually, Contessa, there's a good reason Inspector Fox... Two runners is obviously not allowed, but... But if it was like a, uh, if it was like a co o co o co op <laughs> nice co op uh, category that would be the best. You hit PB in my one second. Well, I PB it in episode three a few times now. The times respectively were 35 flat, 3451, 3445. Three PBs to push it down 15 seconds. When's 528 some of best? Hopefully this run. I have a few segments that I can best segment without too much trouble. And if I compare against a few segments or comparisons here, you can see how I'm just skyrocketed with that episode 3. Because that was a very good episode 3. Far from perfect, but very good. Like if I compare against... This is Cuber. Uh, this is Mikkel. This is some of best. Best split times. Oh, wrong button, nice. Uh, average. I decimating my average save time on every single split except for the reckon where I lost point zero but I eventually tracked down the location of my friends worst obviously eat that up balanced TV though for some reason <laughs> Psychology student, she entered into a whirlwind romance and married a wealthy aristocrat. Sadly, the union was short lived as the general suspiciously died a few weeks after the ceremony. The widowed Contessa put her education and newly acquired estate to work by opening a criminal rehabilitation. I wonder how accurate my some my ac I wonder how accurate my some of best is though. Like how much of that is inconsistent splitting times. I split pretty accurate, but you know, you never accurate enough. But I think it should be like accurate down to, if not the second, then like down to. It shouldn't be more off by more than like 10 seconds. I don't think. This blitz might be inaccurate though, for example. Wrong split key. By way over to the Contessa's house. Maybe I'll pick up a few leads on the location of Sly and Murray. Should I undo that split? I hit X instead of C. Use my favorite streamer? Probably Demon. Demon 9. I might actually undo that split. Maybe I shouldn't matter. Maybe I shouldn't care. 
Yeah, it wasn't only to me late splitting, also mashed the wrong button in the when skipping the cutscene. So I'm not gonna undo it. But I really enjoy a lot of streamers. I really enjoy Ricky's stream sometimes, not always. Um, like, there's a lot of streamers that I like, but there's a big difference between like and favorite. I really enjoy um, Garfield's stream. Garfield the Lightning. He has raided me once. Um, very, just a very good guy. And he plays Pokemon, Pokemon games that I like. So, and then casually, I really like uh, I am Keepers. He uh, streams old school RuneScape. Really like his stream. Um, I want to say Mikkel too, because. But the thing is, Mikkel's atmosphere in his stream depends on the game and the mood. Uh, when he does Sly 3, for example, he's up there. But when he does Sly, he. Um, Sly 1, he can be a little bit more ragey and reset heavy. And then it's not as entertaining to watch, in my opinion. Um, but he's up there when he has like a good stream. Um, who else? I like Joden, actually. Just the way he can just grind and be positive, even though his mic is very weird. I forgot to turn off flow bulls. Which means that I have to do this. Yeah, I don't like Sly 1 as much as Sly 3. That's also true. True. Yeah, Garfield uh, speedruns Pokemon Pearl and those kind of games and Pokemon Black. And white too, I think. But now I'm actually uncertain like exactly what games you run. But check out his channel if you wanna know. Or his speedrun.com profile. Now the left analog stick should control by cyber avatar. Oh OBS doesn't cooperate properly with me either, Cooper. But basically what I do is that I um I open one light split, which is any percent, and then I close it. And then I reopen. I mean, I, I close the splits, so I just have an empty timer open. And then I... While having the empty splits open, I open a new fly split, which is my splits. And then they just fill in. Because I've made my OBS layouts with two different live splits and like, move them accordingly and stuff. But if I close any of my timer, the other live splits will take the, sp the, sp the space of the uh, of the one I didn't close as well as the one I closed. Bentley, what are you doing? X and Y, that's the one I was thinking about.
Yeah, he, he raided me when he got X and Y world record. And I didn't, like... My brain was AFK, so I didn't realize what X and Y was. So I was like, huh? Is that like a rip-off game? I don't, I don't fucking know. I was almost at the point where I was feeling drunk. But like Garfield was, um, he he watched my stream. He likes to watch my stream. He's he's here sometimes. And then I didn't know he was a streamer, and then he randomly just ra uh, raided me with like a hundred and. 20 viewers or whatever, and that was fun. When I just realized that he was like a streamer that wasn't absolutely unknown, that was actually like <laughs> hilarious. <laughs> so I followed him and hung in his stream a bit, two different times. Uh, I use original OBS. The reason why terminal skip works is because in the operation you have a time window after you unlock the uh, the thing, the keyhole, where you can like move around and suicide. But in these hacks, they kind of cut off your movement instantly, so you can't really do that. Unless I take those guys out with my RC chopper. It might be a TAS only thing. If you can die fast enough. But I don't think so, honestly. Also, what, what was funny with the first or second guard in this job right now is that they can shoot your bomb. And he shot my bomb, but it was low enough, like altitude wise, to still damage him. And like deal the damage, so that was funny. Dude, like Pokemon games have all been always been weak with fire types. Say my f my favorite old um, gen is Gen three. At least like the main games, Ruby and stuff. And uh, they have like almost no fire types. It's like Torkoal and Numel, and that's pretty much it. And the fire starter, which means if you didn't pick. You wouldn't have a fire starter at all. I mean, a fire Pokemon at all. I've been playing pretty well for a while now. Hey, Sasuko. Please don't start the entire Sebastian thing. You will get timed out. Well, Gen 3 is 12 years old. Like for me, the old Gen is 1, 2, and 3. And then the semi-old is 4, I guess. And then 5 and 6 are like the new Gens. That's my take on it, at least. You're 12 too. <laughs> nice. I wouldn't be surprised. Jump. 
now because I started to swipe downwards on accident when I drop and just fall down. Well, the Pokemon, I mean, Magmar, is in a funny situation because Magmar is a Gen 1 Pokemon. In Gen 2, he got a, a sibling Pokemon or sibling, sibling evolution with Magby. Magby? Yeah, I think that's how it's pronounced. And then, in Gen 4, I think he got Magmar Star. On a water tower, you can actually um, look at it from a specific angle, and you will see the ice. Didn't see that. Yeah, I also trusted Bentley. Bentley to me has always been this smart guy that you better listen to if you wanna get somewhere, I guess. Because who is carrying the Cooper gang? Sly is doing all the field work. Bentley is making all the plans. Murray is muscles. <laughs> Which is why I think Slide 3 has a very good plot. Or underplot. Subplot. Oh no. I heard the sound so I didn't jump up immediately. Pretty good uh, lightning action. A little bit slow but with getting hits and stuff. I have to be careful here not to drop into the spotlights. Maybe paranoid? I don't think so. I think it's smarter than that. Though he does get like paranoid-ish after the uh, after episode three, so it actually does fit a little bit being here if you were to doubt him anywhere. Since he was so afraid leaving uh, the place in EP3, the jungle in India. No, it wasn't in India. Maybe it was. I don't know. Pokemon Diamond as your first. My first were um, Pokemon Crystal. You can hear double. Yeah, it's because my mic picks up the game. Because high pitch voices travel further and it's easier to pick up. And mentally it's like. <coughs> That's why you can hear mentally. You don't really rec You don't really notice it too much. Though, except for in this episode, because Bentley is talking all the time. Please, no spotlights. Where is the guard? There is no guard. Oh, there it is. Taking the guard there is slow. You can actually make him chase you. And then you can just run up here and he will drop you, and the flashlight guard will run over here. And that will be faster, but it's way riskier. And you also don't get as many coins. And the potential health. If you promise not to be creepy, Sasuko. 
you can get one for only 10 bucks. Kappa B. Okay. This is, a, this is a cool strat where you jump down like a uh, spiral dive there. He almost spotted me. That was clench. No coins. I mean, no health. Fake me. Oh shit. Fuck it. He dropped health that I kind of wanted. That was clench. Can you seriously not give me any health? I want health, damn it. For this jump. Oh, I made it, so... Oh, I hate this guard position. Pretty good code capture. I'm ahead now. Okay, I've been gaining a lot of time. I'm ahead of Mikkel. I'm almost out of best bit times. Head of average, head of worst, head of PB, head of Huber. Good. But this is a job that I've been actually choking on a lot. And I also practiced this job a lot, but it just didn't seem to help. There's only like one change in this uh, job from last run. God. And now I get health. That is to not take damage, not grab coins after the second last uh, chunk of guards. It's not worth it. Also, I'm gonna stay at this HP. <laughs> Don't worry, Cooper. I'm a few minutes ahead of some of worst. Also known as like 18, I think it was. Did he fall down? Did he die? Oh no. Somebody didn't die. That's slow, but okay. I want to take a little bit of damage here. Oh my god. Well, whatever. <laughs> We're doing a let's play strats. And I still fail them. Because I'm bad. I have to take these guys out normally. 
Can I grab help? This is not a very good disguise bridge. It's actually a horrible one. I think I'm good uh, coin-wise though, or money-wise, so I'm not gonna be looking to like, grab coins anymore. Luckily that's only like a few seconds. Maybe like a second and a half. Uh, this is the guys that I want to kill as fast as possible, and then rush over, or I want to rush over to the other side as fast as possible, essentially. It's the only thing that matters for this one. Nice mine. <laughs> I want to rush over here to this spike. At least I'll skip the last card. I haven't actually been able to skip the last card for a few runs now. That's actually kind of embarrassing. I slowed the Sky's Bridge, but I skipped the last card. Which my PB didn't. Of course, but I always skip the last card. Where's the tank? Oh, it's not in a suitable position to damage abuse. I lost 15 to gold there, and that was... Okay. I saved him on Mikkel though. Also, I'm on bad HP for this job, but that's whatever. So in a few seconds. I'm not getting bottles, because this is any percent. Scary. Camera? Oh my god, no, I died. Oh. Kappa. <laughs> They're gone again. A rip deathless run. <laughs> oh boy, somebody has started the level chain. Made you go out of bounds? Fireball? That's very interesting. Episode world record? This can be episode world record, I think. Depends on that guard, though. If he will shoot me into the water more than once, I'm gonna be mad. I don't really mind if he does it once, because that was my own fault for not GSMing him. GSMing him. I had about 14 minutes to whatever time it is now, and then subtract like tw 10. And you have like the optimal time this run can have. Please for the episode. Or actually, not don't subtract those ten. Add those ten instead. That I said, which I think makes it like a thirty-nine, thirty, or twenty-five with a perfect operation. And big hospital, obviously. Feeling kind of strange. You gotta get me out of here. The turret seems to pushed into the void. Mm. If you can get in a big enough fight, the guards will throw you in there. Trust me, 
Speaking from experience. 35, I mean, did I say 35? I meant 39. And like about 30 seconds. That's like the optimal time this run can have for episode 4. You beat the snot out of 50 of those guys, and Bentley and I will take care of the rest. Is 38 possible? I don't think so. Maybe. I don't have my. Uh. Some of best for episode 4 memorized. Uh, what did I punch him? Bad. <laughs> well, I tried to go fast, at least. He didn't die. Shit. I'm not picking up a lot of coins, but I picked up a lot of coins uh, before this bit, so... It's okay. But if you gave, if you, if you, if you made like a bet with me, like say, if you get a 38 episode four, you get something I want, like you get free pants. <laughs> I don't know, but sure. Um, then I don't think I would be able to, even like if I wanted to. Maybe though, I don't have this stuff memorized. That was a bad split. Making the best possible time more like a 35. 39, 35. But I think I can gold this by 10 seconds. But, then again. I don't think that's as easy as it sounds, maybe. Um, um, um. Okay. Okay, Sly. I'm heading out for the tag. Playing to, poke to run Pokemon. Um, maybe Colosseum and XD if I can get my capture card to work properly. Like, it captures fine, it's just that the audio doesn't work properly. So, maybe I would have to do like audio, like music streams or something. Have music or something. Hey, Fow. How are you doing, man? I can save 37 seconds here. Let's see if they fall for it. Suckers. When you get older, Armin, or when your friends get older, I guess, they will not mock you, hopefully. It's something to do about mindset. I have, they have the mindset that, it, that they have to be accepted, you know? And you probably don't, or maybe you do, I don't know. 
I don't have that mindset that I have to be accepted. Yeah, Pokemon gets cool in college, so. Or, I wouldn't say cool, but. Like, honestly, when you, the older you get, the more. I wouldn't say smart, but at the same time, I want to say smart. People become. Okay, I'm going to be s careful with the lights here. Nice. Now I can just charge through, probably. So my movement there might have looked uh, bad, but honestly, I have to wait for the guards to move a little bit anyways, so I didn't actually lose more than like a second to that. Yeah. For us that likes to hang on Twitch and stuff, most people really, really like, like Pokemon and games in general obviously since this is live streaming of games that looks bad i've never seen murray like this he's all twitchy and bug eyed you said murray was being one thing is liking pokemon and one thing is uh and Pokemans, yeah, sure. And one thing is, like, being, I guess, open and, like, if you are to talk to them about it, then that's not the way to go. You don't talk to somebody who don't care or who looks down on something. It's sort of like... This is maybe a little bit weird, but it's almost like running up to a priest and you want to start a conversation and then you're like... So, like any, do you find any of these men in church, like, pretty? And he's gonna like look at you and like, you what, mate? The runs have been bad, foul, but I ended up accepting one that was bad. Nice. And just like, kept going, and eventually it turned into a very good one, or okay one, I guess. My episode 3 was very good, so that made up for a lot. Episode 4 has been pretty damn solid so far. Like, sure, 15 seconds of mistake on the Sky's Bridge. Um, slow uh, brawl, big house brawl. Probably gonna lose terminal skip knowing my luck. Okay, terminal skip, here we go, please. Game plays. Oh, I was one more. I thought I had only one HP or two. Okay, 
Yeah, that should be it. It was pretty slow though. So I, I'm assuming episode 4 world record is down the chitter, but um, very good episode 4, very good time save coming up. Assuming I get it, which I think I did. Been working for 13 hours yesterday and 11 hours today. Ouch. That probably hurts. Wow. <laughs> poor. Poor you. Where is Mary? Oh, okay. Please. So close though. Just snapping this. Oh no, damn it. An okay Murray part, or yeah, part. My head. Who? Uh, not really, Harmon. I no angel. didn't really s s mention it. I don't really see a reason to say, hey guys, I don't like Pokemon, when I know it's gonna be like. What the hell do you like Pokemon, you faggot? Um, so I never told them, I guess. But then again, they never asked, so... If, it, if they asked, if they came up to me and asked, Hey, do you play Pokemon? I'd be, yeah, sometimes. I wasn't really that big into Pokemon during school. Like it was on and off. Oops. Yeah, like I want to say, terminal skip is Jockey and Cooper. Though they, though they didn't work together, they both have gotten it before we knew how it worked. And then I guess, um, Cooper wrote down exactly what he did, like mesh circle and he died and everything like that, and then. We were able to replicate it. Gee, what is this time though? This is apparently a very bad operation. I should start running about now. So. So I'm gonna like get like a 39.50 I think. My first. So maybe even like a 40 blank, which is still a very good time. But considering this was world record pace before the operation, I need to turn on globals. She's getting away. I think terminal skip was was like it took a lot of time to get terminal skip. Sup milk, small thingy, modules, oh like a check mark thing, nice. That is actually very useful, because one day I was, you know, fooling around in, in C's chat, and then I wanted to like check the world record or whatever it was, and he didn't even have speedrun like activated, so I was like, the hell, what do you even have activated, and then I activated like all this utility and speedrun er and everything. Doesn't work like that, uh, Cooper. 
It works like this. Time for a little payback. The Contessa, having escaped us in the prison, is now hiding out in the castle estate. There we go. It's a well fortified gothic nightmare that would make any thief run Yeah, did you fix the aisle stuff? Or not, that's where we're headed. To sweeten the deal, we've learned that the Contessa, who until recently was a secret member of the Claw Gang, is in possession of the Claw Was it this order, or was it the other or, or, or the way around? The previous Raccoonist describes the eyes stopping opponents dead in their tracks, transfixed in their gaze. They yeah, it's still off. An and, like to add on like to what is wrong with that, uh, it News of the shows your most recent time being closest to the case, was granted a cash onto the leaderboards, and that is my episode 5 time. It looks like we're walking into a full-scale war, but we have to act now, before things go from bad yeah, no worries. to worse. How is my sleeping schedule? It's off. I don't have to attend school until um, Tuesday though, so... It's not like it's... Awful or anything. Um. Uh, yes, I did, Cooper. Had a quick death in Mojo. I can save 35 seconds here, by the way, so I hope to save all that. It's a very easy time save. All I have to do is just not die, which sounds easy enough, so I think I can do that. the wrong way. Were you watching the No, I didn't. I wasn't. I was watching Demon Stream at that time. And then I saw they were live and I was like, Meh, I don't give a shit. I'll figure out what they had in store anyway. Was there anything special? I heard about the uh, backwards compat compat to compat compatibility. There we go. This has been like a very good. Ever since um, missing the. Cutting skip in uh, operation in episode two. This has been a very good episode or a very good run. Like mini school mistakes. If I compare against some of the best, you can see me losing a little bit of time, but not too much. I'm actually out of best bit times. That's good for the first time this run. The show Ratchet and Clank, nice, nice. Um, fun fact. Uh, as a kid, my favorite series from the PlayStation stuff was Ratchet and Clank. Mainly because they had more content than Sly. And I didn't like Sly 1. So I only had Sly 2 and Sly 3. Oh, the 
Gotta help Carmelita. She's in trouble here. There's nothing you can do now. Get the recon photos and come back to the safe house. I swear, we'll find a way to help. Interesting. Inspector Fox... Yeah, about a minute to save on the last segment. So that's very, like, nice to have, I guess. Even though it's annoying. Lied about the wheels. Well, indestructible to conventional weapons. That old terminal should be hardwired to the systems in this tower. We need to find a way to get it online. All right, head back to the safe house and we'll get a plan together. Almost gold, nice. Certainly, I'm 56 ahead, uh, seconds ahead. What is a raccoon that wears blue? Any raccoon that wears blue? Okay. The hardest split to do well in coming up. How many coins am I at? 495. I'm actually pretty short in coins. Um, where do I get coins? Okay, I'll take that. It slid me in the right direction. Oh. I usually buy it by the beginning of episode 7. That's the only way to make it accurate, since I always get it there. And then again, we don't get any coins for free in episode 7. So I'd get it... Like, I need 105 coins from this point, and until the end of episode 6. That's that, that's my mindset. And I can get a f uh, like 20 free coins in episode 6. Um, and I get some free coins in this episode. I have to pick bucket and some guards and some stuff. And in the chase of Neela I can also get some coins. Um so yeah. Okay. I wanna have a good split here. Some people have already pointed it out, but this job is What am I doing? It's one of the harder jobs to do perfectly. Because it's very RNG dependent. I like to compare the splits a little bit to like Pokemon. Even though it's very different. Um, you get RNG. You have to react to it. The best way you can. Still not close enough. And now he's out of range. Mm -hmm. 
do what? I thought you can do it from there. Well, it just entered as I. What? What? Game? That's a ghost, guys. That's a ghost. That's a good ghost, at least. A second. Too late. Fuck me, dude. I hate this job, man. Okay, come on, come on out. Save me a lot of time by coming out. Nope. Of course he does. After I have like started heading there. That's neat though. That is like five seconds for free. The free ghost. That's a free ghost. Nice. I thought I was close enough to just smash circle, but I wasn't. Not a horrible ghost capture, but far from perfect. A perfect split there is 530. Mikkel has one in his uh, episode 5 PB. Save time though, so that's good. Mad skills, yeah. Like, even though that uh, split has a lot to do with about RNG, I guess your average split there um, is very much determined by your ability to adapt, I guess, and just general movement and how fast you go. On say like 20 attempts, you get a number that is very accurate. I should I should have grabbed those coins. Shit, they will despawn now. Okay, I pickpocket six guards in stealing voices. That is say we get like four coins. No wait. Seven coins each guard. Seven times six is forty-two. Forty-eight. Forty-two. Forty-two. Yeah. Um, <laughs> that makes me about fifty uh, coins short. Fifty-five. This job can, or this very part here can be very annoying. I'm gonna save it and just go right side. You can't throw him here because there's a guard under the bridge and it actually locks onto him. Guard loots. The thing is. Garut is slow as hell. Garut is like five. Um. You wouldn't by chance know the security code to the castle gates. Five seconds wasted for free. Plus, you have to go out of your way and do it. Seven times seven is forty-nine. Mister Sasuko. H helps. That's a very ducky emote. Um, 
auto trap action. I can save some time. No, I can't. Okay. That's my old PB then, I guess. Whatever. Yeah, you throw rocks. Like it's ever gonna catch me. That's it. I knew she'd have a bad mojo collector to transport the overflow. It's a semi magical device that sucks up bad mojo. This EP so far is good. It's far from perfect, but it's uh, it's pretty good actually. I almost golded Know Your Enemy. Uh, code capture was pretty good. Uh, King of the General was a little bit sloppy, but okay. And now this job is very annoying. I'm gonna run forward and get, grab some coins. If the guards just dropped coins in this job, it would be so much easier. <laughs> the ch sound properly. Chels. Sure. I never understood why this middle one takes longer to recharge. I wonder if it's an actual like bug or if it's an feature. to destroy itself. It's uh, all its magic has been stolen so it has nothing left. Is there anything I can break in here? Can I break this? Ha! I can break this! <laughs> Anything else? I'm grabbing them coins. <laughs> I'm such a greedy person. Well, I do live on Sunmura, so... I guess it makes sense. If I'm really short on coins, I can actually not skip the guards and steal invoices and get a ton of coins from them. Like the the guards where you can just jump on the chan ch chandelier 
and skip them. Only wastes like five to ten seconds. I would assume anyway. Not that I have time yet or anything. Five hundred and seven. That's still pretty bad. After stealing one of this, okay. Chandelier. <laughs> yep. Hey, see, how's it going, man? When is Hundo? One hand. Don't drop points. I'm sad. I'm gonna check them all, I guess. Because I need them, need coins. Time to start running in circles, I guess. Uh, you've been glitch hunting? Ooh. Like, the only person I told about me streaming now was MSA and Jake. And Jake went to bed in episode 1, and MSA went to bed right before I went live, so. <laughs> This shift key, nice. <laughs> Always going all caps. Halfway through the sentence. I'm gonna use this. No, I'm gonna use the one on the right side. Come here. Um, why are you not coming here, your last one? Learn Roshan. Do you mean episode 3 or do you mean Roshan was right? Or do you mean episode 2 even? Nothing here that I can break. Bible thump. Well, I did get some free coins in this uh, job, so... This has been a pretty good job so far. Only, like, fault was uh, a little bit of time loss on the previous hack, or the previous script, because that one guard didn't wanna... Didn't, didn't wanna die. So that's, like, two seconds. The other two hacks were good. No uh, inconvenient guards in the overworld. Uh, I took some damage on the way to the mission trigger, though, actually, I think. Yeah, I got shot by the spotlights. I remember now. That is always a little bit of time. But then again, this gold is without uh, SSD, and this job is like has a lot of loads. And I save time on every load, so... I assume I can go this bit by like 5 seconds. If not more. Do I load after the ghost capture? I mean, kidnap? No, I don't. Okay. Uh... Alright, 
Save time, Pog Champ. Oh, good bits. Yeah, man. Find something. Ugh. 699 followers. Damn. And like 687 before I went live. Based people who follow. And base people who host. Honestly, I don't even think about episode world records until like the last two splits. Seven hundred follower special not happening. I made you like a 700, I mean, 1000 follower special. If I get there even. When that guard had 12 coins. This is gonna fail. I got it! Yes! <laughs> okay. That was pretty clench. Five hundred and twenty eight coins. Highlights. Yeah, I could highlight that. Hey, b -roof. Okay, he spotted me. Not a big deal, but... Yeah, 65 viewers. I've been holding, like, strong in viewers ever since the host from... Uh, from Mr. Uh, Clips. Oh, whatever. Grab these coins. I'm I'm low on HP now. I'm very low on HP. I hoped to like get some magical HP drop, but I didn't. No barrel or something I can break to see if I can pick up health. Rip.
Okay, nice. I got help from him. And coins as well. Though it was only four coins, but every coin helps at this point. I don't fucking good. No, or maybe. I don't know. Thank you, though. Never seen me do this episode. It's not my favorite, to say the least. Pretty good, stealing voices. How should I proceed? Uh, Mikkel had a very bad mojo trap action and a pretty bad stealing voices. So after I split air, I'm gonna. Or actually, let me compare against Mikkel when I split air. Showdown is a merry job. Okay, comparing as PB again. Also, look at that time save on Kuber. That's because he used outdated strats. I said 0.8 to my PB. Pretty nice. Yeah, get that dinner and eat that food, Cooper. This job is very easy to die on. Hopefully, I won't. And di dying here is a minute lost. Plus, plus. Oh, I missed both snipes. Fuck me. Okay, didn't actually do any damage to me, so that's all fine. Didn't die. Or actually, he did. Okay. That was very clutch, but actually, very fast as well. Cryptac. I had a very swift death here, too. Or here in my PB. Nine incoming. What do you mean by that? A thirty nine in episode five is not possible. Episode five world record is fifty one fifty five by me. Okay, I see. Get something for me too. Actually, I'm not actually hungry, so never mind. Give me something to drink though, I'm almost out of drinking stuff. Yes, I did. Yes, I did, Chels. On the very last split, the very last trick, if you look away from one side, which is. saves only a few seconds. Just make sure those traps don't rip you into a hundred little turtle pieces. Why'd you have 
Uh, I've streamed a lot recently, Peter, but I've streamed at very inconvenient times. I stream, like say, I start to stream in four hours from now. That's when I've been started to stream. Or well, that's when I've streamed recently. And I guess in four hours you're asleep, right? So I can save a minute and five seconds on the very last split. How many coins am I at exactly? I should have about 580 by the end of Nila Chase, which is in, a, in the next split. I can get. I don't. I can't get any coins in this job. So that's pretty rip. But I can get some during Neela chase in the operation, where you basically follow Neela around. I'll get you, Contessa. Oh, how many times must you say that? It's not going to happen. Uh, I have PB'd a bunch though, Bidoof, and they've all been uh, uploaded to YouTube. Actually, I'm 5:38. Well. If I play like my gold, I'm on 534 pace, but of course that's not gonna happen. You can skip some of these rafts, but I've never done it, so I'm not gonna do it now. See, found that, or did that. In, I guess, practice. That he streamed. Um, I'm stupid. Why did I go for that? Should have waited a, a little bit. As a quick death, that's very unfortunate, but... What can you do? That's, that's actually not a quick death, that's a costly death. That's a very costly death, actually, because it's... Uh, right before the, uh, the terminal. I was two jumps away from it. What am I doing now, though? Now I could have made it, but now I didn't even <laughs> go for it. Well, I'm losing like 10 seconds here. If I don't die anymore. Which I can, I can die several times more. There's one computer after this. But my gold here is actually not optimized. I can go like 10 seconds or 8 seconds lower. So I don't think I'm gonna lose that much if I don't die anymore. I'm gonna say that 10 seconds is accurate. Though I've been going a little bit solid. Solid, I mean safe. That was not safe though, that was fast and risky. Fun fact, a test would just jump through these rooms without any problems. Because if you jump frame perfectly, you don't even take damage from jumping on the spikes. As long as it's not those uh, spinning things. You probably won't even need those or need that jump strat in a test. This was a very good hack, this last one. Better Fox. Why fight it? Don't you want to be my friend? No, you horrible eight legged cow. No, that old computer powered up. My work here is done. Bomb jump. The hell is bomb jump? 
claim task, that's where I lose time on this bit. I lost 4 seconds, I could say 15. Also 19 to best segment. Of course that's annoying, but whatever. First mistake in episode 5, so... But, uh, see, didn't you get, uh, didn't you go to get something to drink? Operation is Murray. All right, Murray. Head for the castle's main gate and power you can get a massive amount of speed, but you can't take damage, though, in that job. Maybe you can on the way into it, but not not on the way out. EP record at about 11 minutes and 20 seconds. 11 minutes and 10 seconds. Uh, it's 51:25. So if I have a if I have a good operation, then yes. Being Morricon. should do it. Now you're done being a warmonger. Feel like paragliding over to that blimp? Just make sure to grab the rope hanging off that thing. I don't want to drown. Okay. R1 forward tracks. Yes. Hold on, pal. This could get rough. Yeah, I know the episode record. It's it's mine. I got it like a few days ago. It's my it's my most recent PB actually, I think. Or actually, technically speaking, I PB'd an episode three this run by six seconds. Like, believe it or not, this run has a horrible episode two. An okay episode 1, episode 3 world record, a very good episode 4, 11 seconds from record I think it was, no a little bit more, 20, and this episode 5 has been very good too. Yeah, temples, if you hold forward uh, an R1, and as soon as you can see Slice start to, to, to run, you double jump and instantly paralyze at max height, you will always have exactly the right height to just slip in there. If you get high jump, you actually fall too high and you will crash into the blimp's uh, top. Making you grab the rope. And that's slow. So you actually don't want to really high jump there. Was pretty good. Like. Yes, this run is episode three world record by about uh, about six seconds. I think it was a 30, 34, 40, 45. <gasps> Let me check something real quick. Always trying to resolve her problems with the shock pistol. She is rather truculent. Stand clear, Sly. This might have a larger blast than anticipated. Something funny. Um, I decided this dream should last for like really, really long. You okay? But if this PB is then it's like the end of the stream, so... <laughs> uh, this is played on PS3. I have a capture card that can... I guess... Collect... Game, uh, game footage from my PlayStation 3. So I can have it on my PS3 and show it on stream. I'm going after Neela. 
feeling when I've never thought about her bad aim there before. But you're actually right. When she's firing on you, or at you, it's like a lock on to where your position was when she shot. And compared to that, that was like drunk shooting. Okay, I'm gonna look for stuff that I can break for money. For the entirety of this chase. We're running back here later, so I'm not gonna drop down there to risk failing the job. I'm not gonna go up there either. Uh, here's some stuff, isn't it? No? Okay. Nothing? Really? I know that I, I haven't needed. Uh, I'm not usually this low on coins. I want these coins. I got some at least. Uh, are there any here? Could you taking those maybe? That's risky. There's a few right up here though that I'm gonna get. Like these. That was unfortunate spawns though. Only five points. I got like almost no coins from this chase because the chase is pretty much over now. I decided to grab those coins because I was kind of out of the cycle anyways and if you enter that loading zone too far ahead you actually fail the chase but I think I'm actually good in terms of coins I I can get a 20 free coins in episode 6 anyways I need 600 coins, and it's by the, like, technically, it's just, uh, as long as you get them before, before the operation in episode 7, you're fine. You need them before then, but, like, if I want accurate timing, I want, I want it by the time I finish episode 6, so I can purchase it before I start episode 7. That way I get accurate episode timing and accurate comparisons and accurate goal segments and that kind of stuff. Also, if you feel like I'm queuing a lot about sh being short on money, you probably don't want to see my slide reruns. <laughs> Because the money is way tighter in slide 3, because you need like, I think it's like 4 gadgets or something to complete the run. So you need to coin farm a little bit, you need to, and there's no loot, so you have to like grab it uh, by pickpocketing people and such. So it's uh, very nerve-wracking in terms of money. Uh, you can purchase slide two and slide three on the PlayStation Net PlayStation Store for ten bucks if you're interested and have access to like a credit card or something. Actually, on second thought, don't answer that. I really don't want your professional. Yeah, please do see. I I plan to come back to this after I learn Hondo. All I want for now is sub five forty. I needs to be destroyed. Short sighted fool. I have no interest in your hey needles. Um, run is okay. Episode one and two was bad. Episode three and four were good. Episode five has been good so far. Insect. It will be just as easy and more fun to pry it from your cold, dead hand. Ugh. 
Oh, I knocked her down. Damn. Don't fall down again, please. Pretty good, uh. You've shown me the error of my ways. I feel sorry for you. All your Pretty good phase one. You still don't know right from wrong. Hagness and it's currently it's Onila waving. <laughs> um not to let my guard down around an intellectually superior opponent. I feel like it would better be like hey sly or something. She's got the eye. Hey Cooper maybe. Or maybe even like hey there. But the challenge would be to make it seem obvious that it's either Nila or Kamlita. I'm just gonna test that it's uh Shombison's yeah. Shombison's levels. That's hits uh hits all shots. <laughs> Not hey Cooper. <laughs> That would be hilarious, though. <laughs> if everyone's spamming it once you entered. There's nowhere left to run. We both know I can beat you in a fight. So why don't you just hand it? Tastes nice. In a battle of strength, you've proven yourself. Maybe if you uh, say like, "Hey, Sluice or something. I don't know. Hey, SL. Oh my god. Come on. I held down R1. I'm not supposed to hold down R1. Nah, oh my god. Don't fall down. Ah, oh, damn it. Well, so much for this good fight. It's episode record, though. Also, subs my goal for episode 5, so that's good. Good episode 5. Why would you do that? Also, if you have an oven like that in Norway, you're like 20 years behind the normal. Slowly, for a second. <laughs> no, no, it was as an example for uh, a hey guys. Emotes with um, with a slide theme because you don't need the sly name there. Like you have Sluman, for example, which is a big success in terms of being an FFC emote. <laughs> Judging people over their oven, that's me. <laughs> an avid prospector, he took some chances and compare against best times, I guess. Split times. Ooh. Miraculously, the quick freeze kept him alive, and 120 years later, thanks to global warming, he thawed out. Well, oh damn, hey Tyrion. Damming every river and chopping down all the trees with the sharp end of an axe. Shipping spice for the claw gang proved a lucrative way to bankroll his one man war against nature. And yet, I have to feel a little sorry for him. He's just a normal guy from the 1850s. Back in his day, hey Dark Lou, thank you for the good luck. He's a villain. Either way, that man's got more than his fair share of the clockwork parts. Uh, yes, it is grammar. A guy like John Bassan is doing with robot parts is a mystery. I, I do like this episode. Know, yes, it's my favorite. Always, it's only a matter of time before I find out.
15 minutes every hour of break. <laughs> sure, Kappa B. Hey, knife game. When you lose time on an. Whatever. Where am I running? I'm actually running like out of my way. Doesn't waste more than a few frames, maybe, but still annoying. Rookie mistake. Okay. Please, no sound locarinos in before I jinx that. Thank you, knife game. Doorless hype. Uh, I'd rather not see. Oh wow, you're crazy, Peter. Oh, 700 followers. Woo, yay! <laughs> That's pretty damn strong. Thank you for 700 followers. Favorite part of the game, stop it. Stop what? Talking? I'm not gonna stop talking in the cutscenes. That's that's players' that's jobs. That's what you mean. Okay. Uh, that might actually uh it didn't oh I was talking to you okay I see You're hyped for sound lock. For a second there I thought I sound locked. I don't even know if it's possible to sound lock there. Just gonna grab a few coins for safety. Because I've never sound locked entering or leaving a cabin before. And for those who wonder what sound lock is, it's basically a soft lock caused by a loading error that makes you have no sound. Hence the name sound lock. That's something we've called it. Okay, I think I'm getting coins now. I sacrificed a few seconds getting some coins here. Or some few frames, it's not even seconds. Maybe a second altogether. Since I did, did it twice. What's this uh, levels thing? Uh, there's a command that uh, explains it, but basically... Every time you chat... Bot Mikuya gives you uh, a value, and as long as that value is over zero, you gain XP per second or per minute, so, and you gain like points uh, in that way. And then you level up and stuff. It's a way to stay competitive, I guess. It's like. Just a little funny thing, because some people care about it, being the number one and stuff. 
It's also an indication of uh, who is more active in the chat, for example. And as it is right now, it's uh, it's Butters and the Ninjas and then MSA, I think. Top three. And that's pretty accurate, even though uh, Ninjas hasn't been around too much recently. I have a paste bin in my bio. And there's also a command that's like exclamation mark explain those damned levels in one word or something. I've forgotten. <laughs> nice. Holy shit, this is bad. You don't get XP for for spamming though. Look, grammar. Every time you post a message, your value is set to ten. And every minute that value decreases by one. And also every minute you please stop spamming. God damn it, man. Every minute you also get XP. So spamming doesn't give you XP. Do I really have to do it? Do I really have to purge him? I wonder if Wilfred will keep spamming, even after he's finished. Yeah, you only get XP as long as I'm alive. I'm Nico Gasm. I, move, I removed emos that people don't use. To keep it to a minimum, because I think I have too many emotes. I have like... Uh, 40 emotes? Which is way too many in my opinion. He's not lying about it. There we go. I have enough co coins now. Thirty-one, thirty-eight. Yeah, I used to be around. 43, so I remo removed a few. Also, feel when viewer count dropped from like 72 to 66 because grammar is banned. Ew. And the thing is, I like all my emotes. There's no emote that I think is not worthy of being in my chat at the moment. Kramer the spammer. Whatever. Just sit tight. I'm going to look for your pals. Also, this bit was bad because I. I've come to break you out. 
this thing is triple padlocked and Inspector Fox is Because I screwed up getting fake floor like twice. Or didn't screw up fake floor, I screwed up to get charge up to the roof twice. Or once. And then the chimney was also slow. And I'm comparing against the gold, of course, so I'm gonna lose some time here. Sixty nine. Oh, she's <laughs> stuck over there. That's no problem. Why am I almost dropping frames? I'm on the verge of dropping frames. Why is that? I won't hit from that actually. Maybe it's my phone. I'm gonna turn off Wi Fi. She's in such a position she can actually slap me. Fuck my life. That's why I don't like it when she shoots me in the beginning. Nice way to lose time. All because I got stuck on the fucking railing. Because level design. Please no trains. And then I can see a train coming. Why? Because she was between the hook strat or the hook and me, so going for the hook is just as risky. So both the hook strats and the other strats that I well both cage strats and hook strats were just as risky. See you back at the safe house. That's my evaluation anyway, that they were just as risky, on the fly. But I can make up time here again. So let's just say I moved the, the mistake from this split to the other. Had that guy hit me, I would have been so mad. Also, why am I having such an unstable connection? It's pretty insane. I'm just dropping a few frames every here and there. I have no clue why. Quit Skype. It's my computer that's doing something. If I take away that. Minimizing. Whatever usage I have. What is the yellow thing in this graph again? It's received. What is it receiving? Like from where? <laughs> okay. I have to focus on being doing this well. 
I want to save as much time as possible. Go to the gathering now. I've. Same mistake as in my PB, same train. The only difference was that I went safer this time. Can't land on the lock of the uh, the train. I still did it. I was aiming in front of it, but the train was moving. Yeah, I was stupid. So I hit it right on. It's so free as well that time save, but sure. I'm not going to the gathering now. Dude, dude, that's that was almost on it again, dude. Well, I've been playing really well for three episodes, or yeah, three episodes now. So playing bad again is. Yes. It's making up for that, I guess. So far this run has three good episodes, one bad episode, and one okay episode. And then this one seems to be bad so far. But honestly, how do you get a bad episode 6? It's all relative. Episode 6 is so short, and it's so very easy, it's so easy to just not lose time. Uh, is that gonna work? No, it's not. Horrible spice in the sky though. Whatever. Reset the mentality. I've had two out of three splits being bad so far, but at least I'm not uh, short in coins, so I don't have to worry about that. Uh, I have one spot where I usually get coins that I include in my free uh, coins. That is this rock right here. Slang for butt. Interesting.
God, you guys. If I can play, if I can play against, uh, damn, so far ahead. Save time there though, which makes it a good split. But if I compare against uh, best split times, yeah, you can see I've, I, let, I, f I fell behind now. And that's bad, which means that I lost a minute from or since the start of this episode, which is actually accurate. Uh, versus best though. Can't always play you well. I'm still ahead of PB. That's what matters. My goal isn't that great. I will have skyrockets past the best split times after this. Uh, after Burkeb, anyways, because I will not sound lock. Um, I went to the gathering two years ago, or 2014, which will be two years ago at the time the gathering is. It was okay. I'm bad at socializing. Have I improved my, uh, my best bit times? Yes, I have. That's good. A few of those cards were very well executed and really fast. Is that a gold? Yes, it is. Nice. No sound dogs. Good. No sound box, good. Again. Every load the game can sound lock. I think. Oh, I hate having Kilometer here. I don't want her to be chasing me because that changes the way Murray's punches work. Like 
Still didn't punch into the cut into the cut scene now, nice. Into lag. Uh, I haven't dropped any frames since uh, a friend in need. Any word? Like all of them? I thought it was just some, like a handful. Missed the punch. Got the jump though. Don't want to step on it, thank you. Animal abuse. Nah, man, you got it all mixed up. Fun fact: If the uh, the bears are onto you, you should not GSM here because they like to attack you if you look at them with the camera. So if you have the camera the other way around, they won't attack. Sometimes, at least. compare against best split times here. Oh, I wasn't that much ahead actually. Or behind. But you can see what that a run had has died there before. That was my most recent sound lock. When we load, it's just as fast to run, or faster even. Plus, you don't sound lock if you just run. Yeah, that too. The tracks. I forgot about that. Why did I lose? Oh, I missed the, the door and got shut off. Nice. I forgot about that already. If I just keep this lead, I will PB. 
and reach my goal. Okay, so operation is Murray. That's the most used glitch. Depends on the runner. I might actually use glitch, uh, my square boost more than glitch high jump. Since I usually change them like three times in a row. But I guess the average guy uses glitch high jump the most. But then again, I, I'd assume if somebody actually recorded how many times I did high jumped and how many times I square boosted throughout an entire run, the numbers would probably be around the same. Let's say 215 or something, I don't know. I don't know what an accurate number would be. Rip. animation? Nah. It's not too often. It's like 50 times throughout the run, probably. 60 maybe. And some of them you do without thinking about it, like uh, Disguise Bridge, the way we do it now. For example, we drop from the bridge. So that's like, not even Tempted for yeah. Because keep in mind, it's just uh, the slice cutscenes that have been occupied by animation. You're wrong, me blighter. when the episode record would be finished by or by right now if I timed my delay things correctly Slice mission is 60%, but keep in mind you don't skip all the Nokia animations either. Like, uh, I can't think of one though. Like a friend in need. Like spice grinder destruction. Uh Okay, see you MQH. Sleep well. A rock attack. Sub grammar. I've got an upset stomach on my hands, but other than that, I feel great.
That's the mashing of that compared to some others. Well, I only do like 15 in a second. No, I don't do that many. I do like 12, I think. I have no idea. Like 10. But I only use one finger. How classic. <laughs> it only announces per fifth level, so. No, like to, to minimize the amount of. <coughs> wrong button. The amount of spam. Or, yeah. My hand is all. rip now. Things just weren't right up in Canada. Random acts of violence were popular. So that episode six was one twenty from uh well, from perfect. I right. was thirty on a friend in need, I think. I don't know, compared to some of best. Yeah, thirty five and then I lost Yeah, thirty there. Which means I lost fifteen elsewhere, which is pretty good. By simply following the lights, we were led north to an immense lumber camp. The sheer number of fallen trees advertised Jean Bassan's presence and that he was in Honestly not the worst episode 6, but that's some easy time saves for next run. Numerous references to the town slicing through plates of steel. A skilled lumberjack like Bassan could clear a forest in hours while wielding the artifact. Give me level up. Well. Those talons have got to go. Both to finally do away with clockwork and to save the environment from this twisted sense of progress. The world just doesn't need to make space for another strip mall. Dude, my hand feels like I've been working out, dude. Feels like it's thickening. Or like thicker than normal or whatever. I hope we bought the right item. And two, the only way we'll get a crack at our Pegio's clockwork brain is by finding a way to sneak aboard his blip. So hard now waste is shaking or vibrating. That's because I'm uh, shaking my arm though. True, but first things first. This lumber camp I can talk without sh uh, vibrating there too. If I really want to. Senses oriented. Can I save any time in episode 7? I don't think I can actually. Or yes, I can. I can save time on RC combat. To dig in. I can also save like 10 seconds here, if I play perfect. But hey, it's me we're talking about. I never have perfect reckons. Dude, this isn't even faster for for this. It was at this moment, we just knew. He fucked up. <laughs> I just <laughs> love it. <laughs> Job. <laughs> oh, nice reboost. For those wondering, Fow was the one who came up with that joke or that meme. 
on that place. At least the pictures were very good. Those were perfect pictures. Quick spinner and like perfect zoom on every picture and stuff. So I'll post the clockwork talons as a trophy. That should bring in the competition. Is that C slick of every other year? Yeah, I knew it, I knew it. Even I can save like 20 on that, or at least like 18. The original uh, Miku Stair doesn't have the uh, Santa hat, it was actually an update for Charisma's time. Yeah, I can't really save any more time in the entire run, dude. Uh, this is gonna be pain. It's RC combat, and then it's one or two splits in uh, episode eight. I behind? Wait for more global warming. Minute and fourteen. Minute and fourteen. The most over ahead was a minute and eight. No, a minute eleven. Minute eleven. Minute sixteen. How do I redirect that thing? Damn. That means the graph can still be like swung from one time save or time loss. They are temples, they are. I'm sure. Didn't Sly originate from like cartoons? I mean, uh, like manga ish stuff? Comics. There we go. No. Okay. Is it an original concept?
but a horrible split so far. The ending was nice. Something else is coming out of the deep freeze. I've never seen such a majestic creature. So full of life, so ready to live. <laughs> so Can you do me a favor? It depends on the favor. You got the log shopping guide. I cannot reset if it's Oh god, this guy. This guy's gonna if you can snag enough of them, we should be able to me. set up a receiver array around Jean Bisson's house. I'm always up for bugging someone's home. First step is crawling in. Yeah, grammar. And the funny part is I actually cut off a little bit of the uh oh nice. Of the game on the sides. No uh, Uh, I think if you just enter the loading or the area, you auto fail. But I can look into that if C doesn't want to. I mean, C can do it right now. If he wants to, or if he does, if he have a, if he has a save file. Cooper wanted to know if we can uh, just kill the last guard in episode 7 operation instead of uh, luring him with the alarm clock. Which is something I can test, of course, but if you have a save file there, you can test it right now if you have time or want to. Yeah, that's, that glitch is pretty, ne pretty, ne pretty neat, as long as you don't lose your run to it, which I have done. Just have a uh, whatever. I'm gonna leech my entire lead, dude. Gonna be behind soon. Run away.
Uh, we're not supposed to do that. Yet. This episode 7 has been very sloppy. I don't need to be ahead to PB. This is going to be great. I haven't been in any RC combat since that job with holding this damn bull. It was, it was awesome. awesome. Fuck. I can save 30 seconds here. That's my last time save. Until. Here, that's 20 seconds, and then end minute. Best minigame? No, man. Worst minigame in the game. I had a bad minigame and also spent like 10 tries getting the jump on this lamp in my PB. Oh god, here we go again. Okay, second try. Good. Heads up. I might have to play out of my mind in order to PB. From this point on. Hit or miss, oh my. In practice, I am somehow managed to get six shots here. Yeah. Can I get up, please? Okay, pretty good mini game, I guess. Considering considering how it can go. These splits are a mess, dude. It's so tight now that you can't even see how the graph is going. Yeah, fine, Bentley skip, man. Just, just do it. Don't let your dreams be dreams. Just do it. The funny part is, if the run like dies, I have time to do another one, so I might as well. But if I PB, I'm not gonna do another one. If we're gonna get an eagle egg, you'll first have to destroy all the local oil mains. Two min save or thirty second save? You know, uh, better skip it only save a minute. And the goose thing would only save like 20. If that old guy smells fish, there's no stopping him. Use grizzle face to take out the oil mate. If even. Also, I have I have golded a few segments, but I haven't really improved my smell best by anything. This one, like, I had a 17.5. Now I have a 12.7, so that's less than 3 seconds. No, that's less than 5 seconds. When your summer fest is gets optimized, Sluman. 
Don't hit me. Give me that fish, yo. Face is moving towards your position. Face has caught the scent. Give me the fish. Where am I at this point? Hit it extra hard for me, uh, tower. All these guards though, holy shit. I wondered if I did it again, but I didn't. Whew. Here to yodel the strats. Sure, man. Why not? I can't see why I wouldn't. Face has caught the scent. He's coming. Seconds, yippee! I may be tired. Maybe I shouldn't do another run if this doesn't PB. Gloss. Point one gold. Yeah. Sraius GF says he's a butt face. Please, we all know he's a butt face. Oh shit! <laughs> Not over here. No! Fucker! Random save, random dialogue, skip please, Serenos. A lot of people say Syru. It's also easier to pronounce. 
and type. I barely lost time, so that's good, I guess. I just say C. As easy as that. I said someone cuber though. Hmm. Except for the part where I have to swim a half a mile. Interesting. Oh god. Best of times going full crazy. The updraft created by the flame should give me some extra altitude. Ten seconds out of uh, balanced PB. Interesting though, because balanced PB kind of shows how the different episodes went very clearly. You can see episode one was meh, it was okay. Episode two was bad, as you can see. So that was like the last big like downwards spike. That's the operation, and then you can see from the bottom there. That's where episode 3 started, and I played solid from episode 3, from the start of episode 3 till the end of episode um, uh, 5. And then I started playing bad again. And then I'm now playing like all over the place. But comparing as TV. That's the only comparison that actually means something. You can, all, you can kind of see the same thing on these splits though. Because I, did, I didn't have a horrible episode in my PB. Like none of them was absolutely garbage. Like none, none of them were like five minutes off world record or something. Okay, please turn. AOC, did you find mentally skip in a consistent manner? Hey, what's up, C? Spit it out, man. Spit it out like it was snooze. He's gonna shoot me. Of course, shoots me into the water. Then I get proxied away. And then I. <laughs> Can I just get over there already? Nice way to lose like 10 15 seconds. Make sure it hits all those triggers. I haven't missed a single trigger in Boat Tech before. By attaching a boat's grappling hook to the top of the silo, we should be able to deplete power from the battery. Murray's in position to help throw you out onto the boat. Once on board, I'll hack into its steering controls and move the vessel close enough to fire its grappling hook. I'll climb on top of the silo and attach the hooks. How many grappling lines will it take to drain the battery? Three should suffice. Once the first line's attached, Murray and I will commandeer another boat. You should stay in position. Finally, I get the easy gig. Watch out for the bears. I wish I was smart enough to watch out for bears, but I'm not. I can still save some time here, I think, maybe. If I play well. But it's this episode f uh, 7 has been a mess. F 
falling down. Oh, I don't need to do that here. Falling down everywhere and stuff. Okay. Nice, I got this. Fast. NC stupidity, wow. Rude. You can actually clip through the floor here on the boat. Oh, is that too high? Was too much to the side. Feel when I forgot to take pictures of 700 followers. No, Sluman. Quick, somebody unfollow I so I can take a picture. Oh, it would have to be two. That's not high enough. That's too high. <laughs> Got the glitch though. One more grapple line to go, and this thing will be on empty. Realization ship. So, two out of two lines has been bad. Uh, movement to mission trigger has been bad. But the hacks himself has actually been pretty good. So, I'm gonna lose time here, even though the hacks were good. Bentley can't hold can't hold his balance for shit. Uh, the command C is exclamation mark stats or level without the S on the end. Forgot you teleported. Got the glitch again. With the battery chamber empty, we'll be all set to move in. Yeah, I'm losing time. Shit, loves me. King of Furry. Even this slop fest of an episode 7 can be a 45. It probably won't though. Did 
Should I just say episode five? I might have. Uh, can just smash it. Okay, guys. Let's head okay, down guys. with those talons from Jean Bissot. Try your strats. Of course. Who do you think I am? A fake friend? Actually, I'm not gonna try it. Confirmed fake friend. <laughs> I'm gonna have to sit in a more relaxed position. Well, I'm sure enough gonna let you play. I think there's a like trigger around the uh, uh, the table that you auto fail if you enter. Okay, we need to get this fast. In my PB, I was uncertain what to press here, so I pressed both X and Circle for all these inputs. But I only pressed X this time. If I fail one of these, you need to spam zero points in chat, by the way. That emote gets underused. And the angry eagle parent should swoop in and throw off his axe time. You are an instant boss. Thank you, I guess. Not too many people that stream Sly. And not too often. But every now and then, some people stream. I think it's actually mostly speedruns. On Twitch, and then there's a little bit of casual people. But not too many, really. Ninety percent speedruns. I don't think it's that high. I would say like eighty-five. No. <laughs> Can I even make it now? Maybe if I get like the instant cycle. No. Nope. That's the zero points. Rip. How do you even do that? How do you even fail this thing? Please grab it. My God! Apparently, I need to practice that. Great. Also, apparently, I need to adjust the aim if he uses that one. Sometimes I wish I was not bad at this. <laughs> Will I try your strat now? No, I can still PB. I only need to save 35 seconds to meet my goal. I'm probably gonna be behind. And my episode 8 was a record pace up until the last bit. But uh, I still believe. <laughs> I still believe. Uh, this run is so horrible. But I haven't sound locked, so I'm still on 
My best run ever. In quotation marks. Though it doesn't feel very... <laughs> these logs, man. These fucking logs. Did I misplay that? I think I might have actually. I think I'm tired. Yeah, my favorite slide game is slide too. And it's one of my overall like all time favorites. Reset. It's too late to reset now. I could have reset in the early game because it was horrible. But what if I were to lure the judges one by one into that cave? Once inside, you two will knock them out and take their clothes. Genius! Everything is slow motion. Thank you for the host, Cooper Kid. The thing is, emulators for uh, PS2 is very inconsistent. It very much depends on the game. Uh, for the slide games, it doesn't work properly. That's just the way it is. Uh, if you want to know like more about emulators, you should speak English to um, to see. C R Y U in the chat. He's American, so we can't speak Norwegian to him. Nice, nice. You called out. Yeah, but he, all, he wanted to know something about emulators, and I don't know about emulators. I just know they're very bad. First game you ever played. Mm. Well, I'm gonna lose like 40 seconds here, 45 or something, which makes me lag behind PB, which means that I'm entering episode 8 without a lead, and my episode 8 was very, very good, up until the last bit. Which also makes this episode 7 bad, like very bad. So loud. I have a splitting headache. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. What's your point, ninth game? Knife game even. Night game, what the hell? Hey, see, you need to answer the question. You know this. Gosh. See, he answered his question. Like the only person that I know that knows about emulators is C and Nero. And Nero isn't here. There isn't another one? I thought it was two. That was like the main ones. I don't know. This is your favorite part, this boss fight. All this dialogue. This dialogue is pretty funny. I can't see you from in here, but I heard the fall. I'll be fine. Just give me a moment to catch my breath. 
breath. No candy bridges. I should have figured a puny <laughs> turtle like you would find PS3 is an okay PS2 emulator. Through. It's not emulator though. Just drop my glasses, had to come pick them up. I ain't like you, boy. I ain't stupid. When y'all were unconscious, me and my boy. PS4 is supposed to emulate though. I don't know too much about it, but. I like to believe that literally sounds like uh like the, I have a dream. It sounds like a concept for like a speech. I'm gonna lose my entire lead, dude. Plus more. Snip. I wonder if I can like, double hit there with uh, sauce. Let me try that. I should, I should try it right now. Just the mash triangle. That works, doesn't it? Oh, that missed. Rip. Um, that was too early. Nice. What a mess of a fight this was. Well, look at this time off though. I've been done in by some poor right turtle. Times have changed. Once again, brains triumph over broad. Just like at best possible time, just go through the roof. Good job, little buddy. <laughs> that was some fast thinking. We've seen like a minute here. You did a great job opening that door, Murray. Which literally makes it so that sub 540 is like really, really hard to do, to get. Speak faster. Arpeggio, speak faster. Fly, speak faster. Isn't far. If we run, we can make it. Enough talk, let's move. Hey, corrupt. Take a leg. That blimp's on its way. Yeah, I'm losing like a minute. Actually, more than a minute. Interesting. Not more, but almost. Or to my sum of best, I lost more than a minute. Uh, so I guess I need to practice that. I cannot lose more than 30, 40, 8, 48 seconds. I feel when I did the math out loud. If I didn't lose that much though. Ah, oh, damn it, dude. Lost so much. A minute and five. I don't think I can PB anymore. Honestly, I lost a minute and two. I might be able to PB if I play very well, but probably not sub 540. 
We made sure to stay my goal. unknown host, Arpeggio. While attending a prestigious boarding school, so that's kind of lame, but we'll subjects, see. But he never managed to keep up with the other boys physically. Sadly, his wings, due to their small size, I have two splits where I can save time in this episode, and that's it. Furious at his that's the rest body, of my time save. He focused his powerful mind to search for a cure in the works of the Italian Renaissance masters. Their notebooks provided the springboard for the sinister young genius. Try hard. Secret cutscenes? Yeah, I know about them. I haven't really seen too many of them though. Like I have seen them, but I haven't memorized them or anything. It's only a matter of time before he puts them back together. And when that happens, well, I'm not gonna let that happen. Hey, Kaffa. Nice. Lover, of course. You should only have known. I'm gonna finish finish this run regardless, though, even if it dies. I've got it under control. And perhaps I should like do another run. <laughs> nah, I don't think so. I think that's overdoing it. I'm not that desperate all my time. Calm down, Bentley. He might be in one piece, but he doesn't appear to be, you know, alive. Let's stick to the format here. How about some recon photos? Actually, if I, if, I, if I finish this, I don't have time for another one, I, I don't think. Hmm. Just barely. Well, mark my words, if I do one moderately big mistake, my goal is over. He went to the side. Well. I don't think I've seen that many of the uh, secret cutscenes if they're censored or if they're missing on the PS3 version. I didn't move so I didn't run far enough before I square boosted. There he is. The mastermind behind this flip and the source of all our problems. I can't believe it. She must have been working with our There's only uh, 58 people in chat though. And I'm certain a few people are always AFK. I also got a few hosts, so people might be AFK in in those chats. I don't know. Clockwork 
Lurker Master Race. Oh yeah. Thank you for the host, Grammar. Why did I? Sure, that works, I guess. I have no timestamp for this job, so I don't know what to pay someone. But I've golded here in my PB, so I'm definitely gonna lose time because my previous goal was pretty good. I don't know, I I I know that for a fact. But it was with HDD. This is SSD. Um, some communities actually like host larger events and then have their own like chats on the side, and you can like talk with your viewers or something. Say you're a guy with 50k followers, you can host like the the you can host PlayStation for example when they were doing their thing, and you can talk about the updates in his chat instead of the main chat, because the main chat is probably gonna be cancer anyway. Only lost five seconds there, that's good. Yes, Mal. I don't run it at the moment though. Uh, he started late. But when I will do slide 3 again, which is in soon, soon TM, I will be aiming for a record probably. Or I guess my goal is sub 7 for now. It depends. I don't know how much FF, uh, FFC, what? I don't know how much, how much SSD saves on that game. And slash or language differences, so we'll see. There's also a cutscene skip button too. Did it again. I went slow around, way around. Oh my! I just realized that I practiced this and now I've forgotten what I did. I did something here that would give me the uh, fast cutscene every time. I think it went left side, was that it? <laughs> no, I went right side, it was left side I didn't go for. Fuck. Okay, yeah, that's the fast cutscene skip, so that's nice.
I'm actually gonna have to do this. No guards. Hog jump. Attention. If I miss spawn one guard, the run can be over since I have no lead. For those who don't know, I manipulate the guards' spawn locations and everything by panning the camera like this so that there would be no guards in my way, saving me a shit ton of time. We're talking like minutes, and also a lot easier. It does require you to know the map pretty well now. perfectly uh, fast but this is cycle based so there's no way you can make like an make like an earlier cycle if you skip the cutscene let's go okay Give spots. That engine to use. This is back in save time, or the first time save. I sound locked. What? What? I mashed circle. Well, <laughs> rip some of the time save. Uh, I'm not coming to TG. TG, TG, even. That's annoying. This cutscene is very short, so. Why? Time consuming, money consuming, no real interest in going, etc. Fucking hell, mate, that's a pretty big mistake. Especially because the guards in this episode are like really ruthless. So that might be a rip goal. Depends. Well, I'm gonna have to go like majorly over now. In order to 
have a chance. Especially considering this guy's position. Yeah, the eggs like to float in this map. Okay, drop me anytime, guards. Okay, new strats coming up. At least the end there was pretty damn solid. I'm definitely losing time now. Yeah, already losing time to my gold. I think gold is rip. And it's like gold like everything. Which could be happening. I don't know how optimized some of these golds are, as I haven't grinded this episode as an IL. After SSD. You could run all the way around, Cooper. I actually didn't know either, but I figured out in practice. So that guard that spotted me, I really hate that guard, and I've always hated that guard. So I, from past experience, I should have known and waited those extra frames, or like a second extra. Yes, I mean, the thing is, you need to know where, what, where you're going now. And you have to, like, wait anyway. So, it's not a big deal if he spawns, but if he spawns all the way back down there, like he did this time, you might be fucked.
Oh my god, I just realized my PB has like the most insane mer uh, memory parts of this job there is. And I didn't make strats for it to beat it. Because I didn't like see a way to do that. Yeah, I made the fastest possible cycle. CFL, sleep well, man. Bentley's part went fine. Make way for the Murray! I just love that line. It's like the best line in the game. Thank you for the good luck, pal. That's a pretty good memory port as well. Now head into the control booth and pull the plug on this thing. Another engine bites the dust. But the the fact is Keeping up with my gold for Carmita Scanner is pretty much impossible. I can have a gold uh, mega jump by 5 seconds. And maybe this, I don't know. Maybe Finito, also known as the last bit. If I get one side and everything perfectly. But that's probably not gonna happen. But before that, 
it's this job and this job likes to troll you, so... It really likes to troll you. This can be very demanding. Here's where the flesh that guard likes to fuck you over. Oh, nice. Nice auto aim. There is no egg. Nice. There's no flash that far though, that's nice. Very good memory session. No flash that far, just screw me over. This might be gold, I don't know. I don't know how good my gold is. And of course it's always possible to strip the slice parts on its second floor. I actually had a lot of troubles with that in practice for some reason. I wasn't even supposed to practice this part, I just ran through it because I needed to practice uh, the pole thing. Excuse my uh, last PB. Okay, yeah, gold would buy two seconds. Eight minutes left. Less than eight. What's this all got to do with this thing you've got me wearing? I can only lose ten seconds to perfect. Or choose some of best. Or nine. In order to meet my goal. Pretty much means that I have to go with this, I think. Since Chromito Scanner is like in impossible to keep up with.
What emote is that? I can't check, but it looks stretched. I know I can uh, go by 5 seconds here though. Mikkel's gold is like 5 seconds better than mine, so... But then again he does like a... Slight yellow strat at the end. That I don't like to go for. But I have like a... Sort of setup for it now. This is actually very good heights, maybe I can make it without it. Yes. Save time at least. Now this is where I have to save. Um, <laughs> grammar is a little bit late to the gold party. This is where I have to save some time. What? This doesn't add up, does it? Oh, I only need to PB by 35, 36 seconds. That's what I forgot. I'm gonna have to go yellow here though. That's I guess unfortunate. I guess going yellow in this is very risky. And also not even hard. Or also very hard. Might not even pay off. If I die here, I'm probably not even PBing. I lost time even. I need to go by 10 seconds. I can't do that. I can't go by 11 seconds. Even if I play perfect. I can still PB though. Which means that even like a meme strat somewhere would have made this run be my goal. It was a fast-ish launch, but not even perfect. So I can't gold, I think. Maybe I can gold, but I can't gold by enough. Which means that the reason why this won't be sub-540 is that goddamn 
fucking guard. That one guard that I wanted to just... Whatever. It was a bad Chromitus gunner anyway. Rip one side. Would it only save a few seconds? Maybe two. Or maybe I actually can. I don't think I can. I have no idea how long this takes, but the thing is, I have SSD now. Well, I have six hosts. Wow. Thank you for those. Nah, it won't even be sub 540. 540-20. You just want 420, eh? I think it's gonna be lower than that. I think it's gonna be 540... 10. Just, just about. Look how close it is though. I had control of Bentley before 540. Did I end? I didn't even split, fuck. Well, it was like a 540, 13 or something. Ah, 